Do you ever walk past a store and think, how do they make enough money to stay open? My name is Michael Scott, and I sell pigeons in New York City. All right, let's go. I came to Michael's store to learn how he keeps this business open. Give me a kiss. This part I could probably get $150, $200. You know, I've read 500 this year so far. The pigeon supplies right now is probably 50-50. As pigeon sales fell, the store expanded to sell other pet products and even started renting out their pigeons for releases at weddings and funerals. They take the birds to the cemetery, they let them go, and they fly right back. And there's not really a lot of competition. As the industry slows down, one way the store cuts costs is by having cats. Michael says they save the store $1,000 a month by protecting the bird seed from being eaten by rats. Clyde, I'm getting reports that you've eaten birds before. The thing that really keeps them open is owning the building. If I didn't own the building, store could never stay here in 100 million years. Today we learned pigeons can be cute. Cats are a great investment, and high rents make unique stores like this one impossible.